Hello everyone. Today let's use what we have learnt in subtraction to solve word problems. We will call these word problems as subtraction storage. This story gives us some information. Then they ask us to find something. We have to understand clearly what the information given is and what we have to find out when we have to answer. Let's begin with first story. Here, ABC Tourist dot com had six lakh fifty three thousand five hundred ninety one visitors this month and six lakh five thousand three hundred nine visitors last month. What information does it give? It gives us information number of visitors this month we have six lakh fifty three thousand five hundred ninety one and number of visitors last month six lakh five thousand. Three hundred nine, and how many more visitors are there in this month than the last month? We have to find out in this question how many more visitors came in this month than the last month. Let's start to solve this. So we have to write here number of visitors. This month is equal to six lakh fifty three thousand five hundred ninety one, and number of visitors last month six lakh five thousand three hundred nine. A required number of visitors we have to do comparison here in this month and last month. So here we have to subtract from six thousand fifty. Six lakh fifty three thousand five hundred ninety one minus six lakh five thousand three hundred nine. After subtracting, we get here difference forty eight thousand two hundred eighty one. So we can write here thus forty eight thousand two hundred eighty two more visitors came this month than the last month. Now let's see some another stories. Now we read here first story. Daljit and Sarah own trucks. Daljit's truck has been driven seventy thousand five hundred ninety five kilometer in a year, and Sarah's truck has been driven eighty five thousand one hundred five kilometer in the same year. Whose truck has been driven more, and by how much? What information we have here? We have information. Number of number of uh, distance covered from Daljit truck and distance covered by Sarah's truck. Now we have to find out in this whose truck has been driven more and by how much. So whenever we will uh, we will have to compare between two numbers, we have to do subtraction. So let's see solution. How we have to solve this question? So we can write here: distance covered by Daljit's truck is equal to seventy thousand five hundred ninety-five kilometer. A distance covered by Sarah's truck eighty-five thousand one hundred five kilometers. Now we compare both the distance. So we see here eighty-five thousand one hundred five kilometer is. Bigger than seventy thousand five hundred ninety five, and now we subtract this. So after subtracting here, we get here difference fourteen thousand five hundred ten. So we can write here a statement. Hence, Sarah's truck covered more distance by fourteen thousand five hundred ten. Now let's see some different storage. Here. Second story: A family earned rupees twenty one thousand five hundred ninety in a month. How much did it spend if it saved rupees four thousand nine hundred fifty at the end of the month? What information we have in this question? We have amount of money earned and amount of money 
saved okay and we have to find in this question how much money a uh, family spend okay how much money it is spend we have to find so it's very easy you can see here suppose we will earn in a month 1000 rupees okay we will earn money uh, rupees 1000 and we will save 40 rupees then my question is how much money we spend yes correct we spend 60 rupees so what we have to do in this amount of money from total amount of money earned we have to subtract amount of save money so here we can write amount of money amount of money save here uh, amount of money and at 21590 and amount of money saved 4950 and after subtracting we get here difference 16640 so hence amount of money spent at the end of the month here rupees sixteen thousand six hundred forty. Now see third question. In a digital mart, a red color mobile phone was rupees five thousand nine hundred fifty, costlier than a black color mobile phone. How much does the black color phone cost? If the red color phone costs Here rupees eighteen thousand two hundred five. Okay, so what information we have? We have information here. Red color mobile phone cost here rupees five thousand nine hundred fifty. Okay, costlier than black color phone. Okay, and we have to find out in this cost of black color phone. Okay. and red color phone cost we know and how much cost uh, how much costly red color phone than black color phone that also we know suppose we have red pen you have just i am giving you one example from our real life suppose we have i have one red pen you have also one black pen okay and my pen cost is Ten rupees more than your pen. Ten rupees more than your pen. Okay, and my pen cost is twenty five rupees. Okay, my pen cost is twenty five rupees. My pen is ten rupees. Uh, costly than your pen. Then tell me what is your pen cost? Yes, good fifteen rupees. so same way we can solve this question so we can write here cost of black color mobile phone is equal to cost of red mobile minus rupees 5950 so now we have to subtract now we know cost of red mobile phone at rupees 18225 and from uh, cost of red mobile phone we have to subtract rupees 5950 so after subtracting we will get here difference 12275 rupees so we can write here hence so cost of black color phone is equal to rupees 12275 next question number 4 How much is nine thousand nine hundred fifty-two less than one lakh three thousand five hundred seventy? So in this question, easily we can subtract this amount from here. So you see here, we write here one lakh three thousand five hundred seventy minus nine thousand nine hundred fifty-two and we can subtract this from zero we can't subtract two so from here tens place zero will take one borrow now it is ten ones ten ones minus two ones is equal to eight 
and now it is 6 tens 6 tens minus 5 tens is equal to 1 ten and now from 500 we have to subtract 900 we can't subtract so it will take one borrow now it is 1500 uh, minus 900 is equal to 600 and now here 2000 from 2000 also we can't subtract 9000 so it will take 0 will take from here borrow and it will gives borrow 2000 so now it is 13,000, 13,000 minus 9,000 is equal to 3,000. So, 3, we write 3 under the 1,000 column and now it is 19,000. So, we write here under the 10,000 column 9. Okay, and this 1 becomes now here 0. So, now we have some uh, difference here 93,618. So, we can write here 9,952 is less than 1 lakh. 3570 by 93618 Next question number 5 One player under 19 domestic cricket played 6 matches in a season and earned rupees 1,35,550 He donated Rupees 14,375 for a social cause. And how much money is left with him after donation? We have here information. One player played under 19 domestic cricket. Okay. He played 6 matches in a month season. And he earned means amount of money he earned. How much? 1,35,550. And he donated. Means amount of money donated, we have information amount of total amount of money earned. And we have to find here how much money is left with him after donation. So we can write here total amount of money earned and amount of money donated. And we have to subtract this after subtraction, we get here. Difference 1,21,175. So, we can write here amount of money left with him 1,21,175. Now, question number 6. Recently, a prominent personality of Bollywood lost 89,410 followers on Twitter by the end of the year. If he had... 2 lakh followers in the beginning of the year then how many followers does he have at the end of the year so we have here information at beginning of the self uh, that prominent personality uh, followers total number of followers how many it was 2 lakh okay and after that he lost he lost at by the end of the year 89,400 10 followers. So now we have to find how many followers does he have at end of the year. I hope it is clear. Number of followers beginning of the year 2 lakhs and number of followers lost by end of the year 89,410. And we subtract this. So after subtracting, we get here difference 1,10,590. So we can write here. Hence, 1,10,590 followers left at the end of the year. Now question number 7. Question number 7 here. Find the difference between a smallest 6 digit number and a smallest 4 digit number. So we Easily we can solve this. We know a smallest six digit number is what? A smallest six digit number we can write here. This is the smallest six digit number. We have to subtract a smallest four digit number. So easily we can subtract a smallest four digit number. Okay. From a smallest six digit number. So question number 7 we can solve a smallest 6 digit number is equal to it is 
and the smallest four digit number one thousand. Uh, we subtract this. So after subtracting, we get here ninety nine thousand. So we can write hence difference is equal to ninety nine thousand. Question number eight. A stadium has. See everyone, this is the stadium. A stadium has seating capacity of one lakh fifty thousand five hundred spectators. On a particular event, nineteen thousand nine hundred eighty nine seats remain vacant. How many people watched the event? We have to find in this how many people watched. It's very easy. Easily we can solve it. We can uh, subtract here number of uh, to find number of audience. We can write here total number of seats minus number of seats vacant. Okay, so. We can solve this number of audience is equal to total number of seats minus vacant seats. So we know total number of seats one lakh fifty thousand five hundred and number of vacant seat nineteen thousand nine hundred eighty nine. So after subtracting, we get here difference one lakh thirty thousand five hundred eleven. So we can write here hence one lakh thirty thousand five hundred eleven people watched the event. Last question. By how much is eight lakh ninety nine thousand six hundred fifty two greater than one lakh seven thousand nine hundred ninety nine? So we can solve this. We can subtract here uh, from eight lakh ninety nine thousand six hundred fifty two. We can subtract here one lakh. Seven thousand nine hundred ninety nine. After subtracting, we get here difference seven lakh ninety one thousand six hundred fifty three. So we can write here hence eight lakh ninety nine thousand six hundred fifty two is seven lakh ninety one thousand six hundred fifty three greater than one lakh seven thousand nine hundred ninety nine. Thank you, everyone. I hope you like it.